Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Nino and this is my first product review video. I will be posting these monthly moving forward. I have, you know, been using makeup, skincare, hair products for quite some time and I want to share with you guys my ultimate favorite products that I have been using lately. Some of them I've actually been using for a couple months and some of them I recently started but these are I would say the items that right now at this point in my life I'm absolutely obsessed with. Start off with my favorite hair product which is the Verb Ghost Oil. I found out about this when I went to go get my roots dyed and I went to this girl at Fika Salon um, in Hatboro. I really hope I'm getting that right. If I'm not, I'm really sorry. And this was back when we were living in Pennsylvania still. And I was pregnant with Gianna. I had just found out that I was pregnant with Gianna basically. So this was spring of 2021 and ever since then um she used it in my hair and i absolutely loved what it did um basically it's a protective oil for your hair before you start blow drying it straightening it curling it whatever it is so i love this i get this on amazon and it works wonders the next item on my list is the Heat Fenty Beauty product. It is a lip gloss and the cool thing about it is that it's also a limp pumping um, lip gloss, which I absolutely love. Um, I, if you guys can see, am already running out and have to get a new one. So I will definitely be going back to the store for more and I got this in Sephora. It's not just for going out. I think it's the perfect color tint and it gives your lips like that little bit of plump that it needs and it's super glossy and I've just really been loving that look lately. And the color of this one, if I'm not mistaken, is Fussy Heat. Next, um, I want to talk about this product here. So this is a skincare product. It's from the brand Dermatology. They sent me a couple of items and to really try out, I'm not doing anything with them. This is not sponsored. This is not an ad or anything of that nature. This is simply just a product that I use and that I have actually grown to really like. And I've used, been using this for, I would say, a couple of months. Um, I don't use this product in particular on an everyday basis, but I do use it once in a while. I only use it at nighttime. And when I wake up the next morning, I do feel like my face has had a little bit of like a lift. And I don't know if I'm using the right words, but it just feels like I have this little plump to my skin and it feels so nice. And I make sure to always like wash my face with cold water in the morning. And so then after I wash my face, I feel like my makeup just glides on the next morning. So I do have to get better at remembering to actually put it on every single day. That's been my biggest struggle, um, mainly due to pregnancy. My pregnancies have not been that fun. So my nighttime routine has significantly, I mean my morning routine too, but um, my nighttime routine in particular has significantly had a, uh, you know, a tragic decline. Moving on, I would say these two products come in third place and they are also both skincare products. So honestly, I have watched a ton of makeup YouTube videos and the, all the, you know, influencers who do all the makeup videos and they talk about the skincare and like all of that the Tatcha Soft Cream Cleanser, the Skin Cream. This I use pretty much every day now for taking off my makeup. And then I'm obsessed with this moisturizer. I have never felt my skin so soft. Well, I mean, I felt it soft, but like what this does to your skin is just unbelievable. And not to mention the fact that you literally just want to 
keep smelling like literally just open like carrying this around with you all day long and just oh my god smelling it now one of my other favorite products if you guys follow me on instagram if you don't my it's the same handle as my name so nina Oriel. becky and i do these live coffee chats every single tuesday so if you want to join the conversation just go on our instagram or our youtube channel every tuesday between 9 to 10 a.m and on one of our lives i actually talked about this product because this was one of the products that i recently purchased so this is the Ilia, and again i still didn't look it up i'm sorry how you actually pronounce this company but it's spelled i-l-i-a so i'm assuming it's Ilia, which is funny because my husband's name is Ilia, but he just spells it with a y instead of an i and this is the uptown night light bronzing powder it is i love the packaging i'm sold on it i love how neutral it is it's clean it's compact and it has the mirror inside but most importantly it is super pigmented it is matte which is one of my favorite things so it's not super bright the next product i have here is fenty beauty match stick that's what they're calling it and this is in the color Swedish number 10. Again, I will link everything. This is a contour stick by Fenty Beauty. So obviously, as you can guys can see, I have really been liking the Fenty Beauty line. Um, that was like, how does this? So there we go. And again, this as well. I love that it's matte, so it's not going to make your face shine and shimmer during the day, especially when you are, you know, going into work like myself and you just need to add a little bit of life to your face because you have two kids, you have a baby and a toddler and life is crazy at home and you just want to look presentable when you get to the office or when you are meeting with a client. Literally just use a tiny bit of this on my forehead, on my cheek here, on my nose, and a little bit on my jawline just to give me that extra definition. I don't do heavy contour, but I do love this to just add a little bit of definition. Last but not least, one of my all-time favorite products right now is the Fenty Beauty Concealer. So finding a concealer as most of you ladies know is very difficult it is very difficult to find a concealer that does not crease is not too bright and not too pink and not one that basically wears off throughout the day or one that is you know strong like it's doing what it needs to and concealing that under eye but also buildable and in a consistency that is easy to blend with your foundation i honestly think that they have literally nailed it again i am not a beauty queen here i'm just showing you all of these products from the perspective of a everyday busy working mom of a baby and a toddler me just sharing with you guys what i use on a daily basis and what i have been absolutely loving so that's it i hope you enjoyed watching my first product review video stay tuned for my product review video that will be coming out in may and yeah let me know what you guys think i will have all of these eight products linked below this video so if you want to try out the product yourself or just know exactly the name and the color and everything of the product that i'm currently using you can just like i said check out the links below if you have any questions and if you have a product that you love and you think that i should try it out let me know Thanks for watching and please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I love you guys and I will see you later. Mm -hmm.